guys, it's Jill coming at you guys with a little vlog that I have decided to film on this rainy day. It's pretty gross outside, but I think that there is a break in the weather. So I am going to go get on my boss's new horse. He is a little chestnut thoroughbred guy that we have decided to call Six. He is just an absolute saint. He came to us with a lot of rain rot and not a whole lot of groceries on him. So we're slowly getting him back to looking like the show horse we know he can be. She's out of town this week for spring break so I am riding him and I am gonna go get on him and take you guys with me. So let's go. Do you need to come say hi? Are you coming, Rue? <laughs> hi. Hi. What's up, Rudy Rue? She says shoulder, please. This has become our handshake. She walks up and gives me her shoulder for scratching. They're so teeny tiny bean. Oh, good itch. Good itch. So itchy, we're shedding. Really? She's so muddy now. She loves to play with the horses. And the kids love to play with her. My kids, go get that dog. <laughs> you are a mess. Captured. Does not look thrilled about it. You see what I mean about his coat? Is, his coat is actually quite healthy, but he was body clipped when he had rain rot. So there's a bunch of Blotchy spots. Apparently we are leading the whole herd with us. Are we all coming? Oh. That's too cute. So I'm too lazy to put my phone back on the tripod, but I just wanted to mention this stuff. This is not sponsored. This is a product that my boss bought and that we have been using for quite some time to treat rain rot. Non-toxic, talc-free. The ingredients listed are proprietary blend of sodium bicarbonate, maranta, arrowroot powder, bentonite clay, cornstarch, and peppermint oil. It is called coat defense and it's great for rain rot, fungus, odor, bacteria. I'm not sure how it works and I'm not sure what all it works on, but it has done a great job of preventing and getting rid of the rain rot that our horses have been dealing with and all of this wetness. So I'm gonna throw this on his white feet because he's prone to scratches real fast and then we're all done. And of course, because he is the goodest, he gets a little alfalfa pellet, trying not to get the stuff all over it, but I did get it all over the ground. So that is it, Mr. Man. All right, you guys, ending the vlog in my bedroom before I forget, I have given the dog a bath and yeah, 
It was a pretty good ride. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and enjoyed seeing Six. Don't be too judgy about his appearance. He has gotten a lot better and we're still working on it. But yeah, also enjoy my acne. It's pretty great right now. I'm living for it. It's amazing. That's why we have helmets on, <laughs> right? Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to check out the Aqua Theory podcast and I'll see you guys in the next one. Oh, oh, oh.